Donkey Kong by Ocean. Uh, never had this. Uh, I love Donkey Kong in the arcade and uh, had it on the ColecoVision in 1984 when I got a ColecoVision for £50, brand new, and uh, I think the games were 10 quid, uh, cartridge games, and I spent 25 quid on Turbo. So I didn't really feel the need to buy Donkey Kong on the C64, but this is the best version actually, the uh, one by Ocean Software. Uh, £10 on tape, so 30 quid, $40 uh, cheaper than the NES version, which doesn't have all the levels, unlike this version. That look more like the arcade now. I put the colour up in it. And it's not coming out according to the LCD on the camera. Yeah, I don't want the hammer because you can't go up the bloody uh, ladders. Uh, it's not really going to make a difference if you walk into the barrels. So, sit rep. Uh, the £125 uh, C64 from the uh, Tales of the Unexpected um, is the only one that actually works properly at the moment. confident with the jumping. Enough already with the barrels you cocksucker. There we go. So yeah this is also on the Amstrad and it's also good on the Amstrad too. Um, wouldn't buy an Amstrad if I already had a C64. Um, that was close actually. Oh man, see that just come down straight away. What an arsehole. And I can't get over there. Ah, luckily you only have to get to the top level. So that's the level that's usually missing. You're gonna bloody stay up there one now, so. quite a, a tough version obviously I'm using a zip stick so you know um, but the same tricks that work on the arcade uh, to help you out also work on here so no idea what happened there but uh, yeah, that's Donkey Kong, and that's really good, the Ocean software version.